I really hate it when men are like, if I'm paying all the bills, then you should at least be cooking and cleaning the house. I should come home to a meal. Motherfucker, if I wasn't here, you would still be paying the bills. <laughs> the things that you do that you consider is for our marriage, you would be doing if you were single. Okay? When you get benefits from your job, I don't really get those benefits. You do. If I left right here, you would still get those benefits. I wouldn't. Your check don't come to me. So therefore, I don't give a damn about how much you work because you was working before and you're going to be working after you met me. I don't care how much you work. A hard working man is nothing for me because you're going to work hard with or without me. What are you doing for me? Nothing. That's why I don't do nothing for y'all. So listen, there are some women that are meant to be single for the remainder of their life. And... This clip reminds me that this is one of those ladies that are gonna be single for the rest of her life. Now, rest in peace, Kevin Samuels. He says that, you're gonna die alone. You might as well get some cats, get some dogs, and, and get some pets, because that's all you're gonna have. And women that speak like this, and it's not all women, right? Because I, I just uploaded a video with a lovely lady who's extremely feminine, but women that provide this type of energy, man, just run, run, run away from these type of women. They're no good. They're not gonna build you. They're not gonna encourage you. They're not gonna nurture you. If they treat you like that, imagine how they treat your children. You know, if you're paying all the bills, that means you're out of the house 70 to 80% of the time. And you're out there grinding, the world's beating you down and you come home and your woman thinks that she should not cater to you at all. Nothing, not even, a, not even a sandwich, not even a sandwich. She shouldn't have to clean up and, and you know, she lives there. She shouldn't have to clean, you know? Women think mopping their own floors is, is a life of servitude, which is, which is crazy to me, you know? The, the floors that she's walking around on, she thinks grabbing a broom and grabbing a mop is, is servitude and she shouldn't have to do it, even though she's not paying no bills. Like, what do these women expect? You know, men cannot go around the world without obligations and accountability. You know, we're obligated. We're responsible. We're responsible for a lot of people. You know, you just can't just run around this world thinking that you can shun your responsibilities lay down and things are going to be productive in your life you know only women like make make these bold brash ignorant statements and put this shit on the internet to influence other women into thinking that this is okay behavior this is abnormal behavior this shit goes on go, goes against every kind of traditional value there is in the world and they wonder why they're unhappy they're wondering why the uh the, the 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 marriage rate the marriage rate is declining the divorce rate is inclining you know single motherhood is on the rise like all these statistics that are that are not in their favor is because they treat men this way they treat men like they're disposable they don't need them and then they don't have to cater to them at all and we're just walking walking piggy banks and walking ATMs <laughs> guys which one of y'all signing up for this woman which one of y'all getting in line to be the next guy to date this type of woman. Let me not just say her. This type of woman. Because this type exists. Right? This type is out there. And they're under this disguise. This makeup. This filter. They're under this disguise as a very high value woman. Well. <laughs> what do y'all think? Hit the like button on your way out. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Got more content coming your way. See you guys on the next one. Peace.